Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of GIS Answers. Today we'll be showing how to use the clustering tool in order to visually present points of interest. So we have the parks in Miami and the world topographic map and the world hillshade as a background. And we have parks and we want to cluster these into basically groups. Click on the parks layer in the table of contents, go to appearance, aggregation, Clustering. As it says, clustering is aggregate point features into dynamic point clusters. It clusters into um, different sizes of circles depending on the number of parks within those areas. And as you zoom in, those numbers will change. They'll break up basically to get more circles. And as you zoom out, the clusters will become larger and the numbers within those, obviously that's 61 parks are within that circle, 36 between this one and seven within that one. So as you zoom in, you get more individual clusters. So that's an alternate way to the method of showing heat map. Duplicate this, I'm gonna copy and paste. So we've got both layers. We're going to make one layer a heat map. What we'll do is make that heat map below the clusters. Increase the radius. So in this case we've got combination. We've got the clusters and the heat map combination of both. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, please subscribe to the channel and we'll see you again. Thanks.